Anthony Fasano here from Pass the FE Exam. Our FE practice problems and solutions are step-by-step -step reviews to prep you to pass the FE exam. The problem in this video is of a geotechnical investigation at a proposed road construction site that contains a subsurface clay soil layer and looks at the consolidation of that layer. Today's problem is brought to you by Prep FE. Prep FE is one of the most effective FE exam self-study prep services out there and happens to be one of the most affordable too. Prep FE is an app that gives you access to countless sample FE problems to bolster your study efforts. You can visit prepfe.com forward slash redeem and use the discount code in the description of this video to receive 10% off and get some great FE practice problems. So let's dive into this week's consolidation of clay problem. The question is, a geotechnical investigation at a proposed road construction site spotted a seven foot thick weak clay layer, 10 feet below the ground surface. On top of the weak clay layer, there is 10 feet of fill material. A sample was obtained from the drilling investigation and was subsequently sent to a lab for testing. The lab results for the weak clay layer and the fill material layer can be seen to the right of this problem. Assume building a road on top of the soil profile will increase vertical stress by 100 PSF at the midpoint of the weak clay layer and the clay layer is a normally consolidated clay. What is most nearly the primary consolidation of the weak clay layer? Okay, so you could see here what was given. The height and specific weight of the fill layer, the height and specific weight of the weak clay layer, plus the initial void ratio, EO, and the compression index, CC, and lastly, the potential answers. So let's start by determining PO, which is the initial effective consolidation stress, PC, which is the past maximum consolidation stress, and delta P, which is the induced change in consolidation stress at the center of the consolidating stratum to figure out which consolidation settlement equation to use. There are three possible equations for consolidation settlement. We must choose the right one. And again, I'll show you the three of them in just a few moments here. So again, PO is the initial effective consolidation stress or the total stress at the midpoint of the layer in question minus the pore water pressure. And you can see the equation here where sigma zero is the total stress at the midpoint of the layer in question. In this case, the stress at the midpoint of the clay layer will be the sum of the stresses above the midpoint. And again, you can see the equation here. Since we were not told about a groundwater table, we will assume the ground is dry and the water table is somewhere below our layers in question. Therefore, pore water pressure U is zero. Now, go back and solve for P zero. We were given delta P to be equal to 100 PSF. We were told in the problem statement that this was a normally consolidated clay layer. Therefore, PC equals zero. Now, figure out the appropriate settlement equation to use. You do this by using the equation here that you see on the screen. And then you'll look at the FE reference handbook. You'll see the three different equations that I mentioned earlier, and you'll have to figure out which one to use. And based on the results that I just showed you, this is the equation that we must use. So now we simply plug in our numbers. And therefore you can see after plugging in the numbers and using the right equation, delta H is equal to 0 0.3 inches. So the correct answer is A, 0 0.3 inches. And of course, the biggest component of this problem is making sure you figure out the right one of those three equations. And you can do that by walking through the steps that we laid out here, step by step. If you didn't get it the first time, go back, rewatch the video, take it step by step. And I'm confident you will get the correct answer. I hope you enjoyed this week's edition of Pass the FE Exam. We publish videos weekly here to help you pass the FE exam, so please be sure to subscribe to our channel. This exam is critical in your career, and you want to make sure that you're ready to take it and conquer it. I'll see you next week on Pass the FE Exam.